There could be a time when your iPhone acts up. You know, it could be stuck on the Apple logo screen or stuck on the recovery mode screen, or it could be one of those mind-numbingly annoying loading icons that just won't go away. And depending on which iPhone you have and which iOS version you're running, there could be multiple solutions that exist. But if you really want to make it convenient for you, you could get a software called Reiboot, which pretty much gives you solutions to any and all common iPhone problems. But before I actually demonstrate the software, here's what it can do for you. It can help you get in and out of recovery mode and address all of these problems. It supports all iOS versions, including the latest iOS 15, and the software is available for both Windows and Mac machines. So you don't necessarily need to have a MacBook to fix your iPhone. And also, if you have any kind of doubts as to what kind of issues this software can help you uh, fix, well, here's a list of all issues it can resolve. So depending on what your problem is, you can check and accordingly pick up this software. So yeah, I would encourage that you go to their homepage and figure out if this is really meant for you. But let's go ahead and demonstrate the whole thing. I have a Windows machine, so I'm gonna download for Windows. And once you run through the setup, the software is installed. Now, if you first run the software, you'll see that it says, please connect your iOS device. And as soon as I do that, it recognizes my device and it gives me a confirmation that you know the iPhone 11 is indeed connected right there. Now let's say I want to get into recovery mode for any kind of iOS updates or downgrades. Just one click on the software and I enter into recovery mode. It's completely free. You don't need a pro license version to do this, but yeah, just with one click and there you go. I'm into recovery mode. But let's say your phone was stuck in recovery mode or you just wish to exit recovery mode with one simple click. In that case, you can get the licensed version or the pro version of Reiboot and it makes it super simple. And so once you buy the licensed version, you will receive a registration code linked to an email ID that you provide and you can just register with that. And that's it, you're then upgraded to the pro version. And now you can pretty much do everything that the software lets you do, including exiting from recovery mode or coming out of a stuck recovery mode. And yeah, it was really that simple. It doesn't take too long. It's just a push of a button and that's it. It's gonna give you that confirmation and you can wait for a while as your phone loads back into its normal mode. Now, this was all easy stuff, but let's say you're stuck with a more complex problem, like your phone stuck on the Apple logo and just won't get out of it. Or it could be any of the problems that you see on the screen here. And sure, some or the other problem can be resolved without using Reiboot, but the whole point of having Reiboot is to not go to different places for different kind of solutions to different problems. You can have all of that figured out in one place with Reiboot. In that case, the pro version or the licensed version of Reiboot is super amazing. So let's say right here, my phone is stuck on Apple logo. And then all I have to do is connect to my computer, which already has the software installed, the software will detect. And then I just have to go into iOS system repair, wherein I get two options. Do I want standard repair or deep repair? The main difference is that in standard repair, my data is not lost. Everything remains intact. It just repairs the device. But if standard repair fails to work, that's when you go for deep repair, but you would lose all your data. Anyway, let's go with standard repair and see how that works out. It's gonna prompt you that it's gonna download the firmware for you depending on which iPhone and iOS it's running. And then of course, depending upon your internet speed as well as which iOS firmware you're downloading for your phone, it's gonna take a while. And once the whole thing is done, it's gonna to start to verify the firmware package uh, just to check whether you know the whole thing is intact. So it can load onto your phone. And yeah, after that, you're all set to start the standard repair. It's gonna verify the firmware package, as I said, and it's going to unpack, and that's it. Uh, it's gonna start upgrading or fixing your phone. So as you can see, the process has started and it can take anywhere between uh, four to eight minutes, depending upon how fast your computer is. But yeah, I've I'm just showing you a couple of snippets. Uh, I'm not showing you the entire process because I don't want the video to be that long. Uh, but yeah, it works. And you can see on the right, the phone is almost Done, all right, so you get the confirmation from the software side and yeah, your phone successfully reboots into a working condition. And as you can see here, I'm gonna just unlock and it's just going to work absolutely fine back to where it was. Now, please note that I'm not saying that there aren't other ways of fixing your iPhone problems. I mean, if you've got Apple Care or Apple Care Plus, you can definitely take your phone to the service center and get it fixed for free. But hey, you're gonna have to go submit your phone, probably take one or two or three days depending on where you are, and then you're gonna get the phone back. So sure, it's a pretty sure shot way of getting your iPhone problem fixed, but it just involves a bit of delay. 
And hey, if you do not have Apple Care or Apple Care Plus, you can still follow the same process. It could cost you a bit more. But this software just makes it easy. Um, yeah, you can also do a lot of research on the internet. You can find articles that help you, you know, perform all the steps manually for free. But it's just going to be a risky, and B, you're going to spend a lot of time doing that because it, you know, all the steps vary depending on which iPhone and iOS version you have. So, all in all, it just puts everything in one place for you and just does it for you. So I think that's where the power of Reiboot really lies. And hey, if you guys still have any doubt or you're not fully convinced that your problem could be solved with Reiboot, probably write to the Reiboot team and see if they respond, uh, telling you whether they have a solution for that in that software or not. I think that would be a great way to go about it. And by the way, if you do visit their website, there's a Black Friday sale that's going on across most of their products. So you can see that there are some products that are available at special price of $9.90. Some are under the buy one, get one offer and some uh, free stuff and even some that are under 70% off. You'll find all relevant links and pricing in the description below. So make sure you check that out. And that's pretty much it guys on the Rei Boot software. If you guys have any questions, let me know in the comments section. And as always, do hit that like button, subscribe to the channel and hit that bell notification icon. I'll see you guys in the next one.